Hi, I'm Tina O'Dwyer, Tourism Trainer, Facilitator and Clarity Coach. Welcome to my weekly vlog. Today I'm speaking about high performance tourism networks and in particular how they can generate meaningful local data for destinations. Every week I meet people and networks in destinations who believe they're successful because of the number of visitors coming to their destination. This is a false metric. Numbers of people who set foot in your destination is not an indicator of impact. It's simply a sweeping statement of the quantity of people on the move at a point in time. The impact that these people and networks say they want to achieve relates to the average spend, the average length of stay and the spread of visitors around the destination. So we've a mismatch between what we're measuring and what we actually want to achieve. I believe that cultivating high performance tourism networks in a destination can lead to meaningful data that can support decision making and planning. How's that? A strong network will be representative of the destination. Simply issue an online survey using free software to your members at the same time every year and measure the output over time. And ask questions about the things where you actually want to achieve impact. So for example, you want to increase the average length of stay. Ask the accommodation providers, what is your average length of stay? Use year one as a baseline and then track that over time each year when you take the survey. To track spend, ask all your members, is your average spend increasing, decreasing or staying the same? Ask them the same question for spend per visitor. That's the average spend. How's that going over time? To look at spread across the destination, maybe a slightly different approach, you can analyse your overall membership, see how many, how many tourism enterprises are in the destination, where are they located within the destination, and how is that changing over time. And then supplement that information with questions like, how many people do you employ? How does that change? What is your overall number of visitors? Is that increasing, decreasing, or staying the same? And what is your confidence like in your business for the coming year? And that's a strong indicator of future investment and future expansion. So there's some simple ways that high performing tourism networks can provide meaningful data and that can support decision making and planning at local level, which is where the impact is sought and where the impact is felt the most. 